Hi, welcome back to Circuits with Angel. Today, we will learn about direct and alternating currents, and what we use both for. So first, let's start with DC voltage because we use it in our circuits and get it from our batteries. We use DC current to run simple electronics, computers, laptops, and much more. DC is really easy to understand because it only flows in one direction, negative to positive. Now you may be wondering, what do we use in our house's power outlets? The answer is AC current. AC current means alternating current. This is because it changes from positive to negative really fast. At left per second. Like 50 times in Europe and 60 times here in Canada. We usually say AC current is really dangerous because if you short circuit it like using your body as the conductor, then you'll get electrocuted and kinda die. So always remember safety first. And don't put your fingers in any outlets. Just to be clear, we use AC current to run household appliances like an electrical stove or a washing machine. We use AC because we can transport it over long distances without too much power being lost from the power plant to your house. But after it gets to your house, most of the AC current is turned into DC current by a converter, which you can find on a laptop, battery charger, or a Chromebook charger. Well, that was a bunch of information about AC current because it's important. But we use DC in our circuits because of reasons I've already stated, like most circuits run on DC current. So here's a quick summary of what you should take away from this video. There are two types of current, DC current, direct current, and AC current, alternating current. AC is used in our home outlets. It is dangerous because it can electrocute you if you short circuit it. All of my circuits are DC powered, so assume that unless I say otherwise. Thank you for watching and see you next time.